Hey, it's my Amazon guy. I have noticed that there is a massive shortage in the supply chain in many key areas still as two examples affecting me personally. First, uh, I tried to order a bike for my four-year-old kid. Womb is completely sold out, like not a single bike available. It's crazy. I went down to the bike shop. My son is at 46 inches high and it's like right between the sizes of like doing the 16 inch tires and the 20 inch tires. So he's like too big for the 16 inch and too small for the 20 inch and it's like that awkward size anyway so we couldn't find a bike that would fit him and i was shopping around and it's like impossible to find certain things so like womb completely sold out right second example uh so i sell funny wine glasses with sayings i have the brand monster many of you guys have seen dozens of my videos where i talk about my successes my failures so we we were trying to order a direct order for glass out of libby and, and we're gonna start manufacturing them uh, directly ourselves and, and doing, doing some of the, uh, the design work at our own warehouse, right? So uh, if you don't know, Libby is a very large glass company. Um, and so we, we, we were under the impression that we had to make a very large order for them to let us you know, order a direct order from them. And we're not gonna resell uh, their glasses directly. We're just putting designs on them so they shouldn't, shouldn't be a problem, right? So you know, typically they won't open an account unless you order 50,000 glasses, which is basically a $50,000 order or so. And so we're like, hey, you know, we, 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 we could probably commit to that or commit to something close to that. And they're like, okay, no problem, we'll open an account. So we look at what we want to order and we try and order 30,000 glasses. And they're like, oh, we're so sorry. We actually don't have enough glass on hand to fulfill your order right now. So like literally there's a glass shortage and, I, and I've actually known about the glass shortage for about six or seven months now, but I'm just flabbergasted. It's like, we saw wood prices go back down about 30% last week. Uh, so there's like a hope in the end of the tunnel, right? There's a light at the end of the tunnel here that the supply chain might like finally be fixing. But just like a month ago, I had to lock in a 20, um, a, a really large container filled to the brim with my stuff out of China and it cost me $9,000 to ship a container. And two years ago, that would cost like 3,400 tops, like max, right? And so it's like 300% up. And so like, there's just so much weird stuff going on with the supply chain right now. And I'm not sure what you guys are seeing. I'd be curious, feel free to leave a comment on, on this video with what you're seeing with the supply chain. How are you being affected? Are you able to manufacture your stuff? We just had Prime Day uh, this week. How did you do for Prime Day? Uh, I think it was kind of just sixes wasn't great wasn't bad for most people as far as I can tell uh, And you know watch these videos if you're curious about our other logistics issues and supply chain videos My name is Stephen Pope, and I'm the founder of my Amazon guy